Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, the newest and first female national spokesperson for the Boys and Girls Clubs of America, ladies and gentlemen, Jennifer Lopez. What? Okay. Don't scream at me. <laughs> um, thank you, Denzel. You know, this is, I have a speech and I'm going to say it, but this is so inspiring. You know, I, listening to Mona and, and listening to Denzel, and Mary, and everybody here, it just, it just takes you back and it makes you remember how impactful these things are and how important they are. So thank you, Denzel, Roxanne, Frank. Frank is from my old club in the Bronx and all the members of the Boys and Girls Club of America. This is a very exciting day for me. It really is. Joining Denzel as the national spokesperson for the Boys and Girls Clubs of America. And it is especially meaningful to become the first female spokesperson during this 20th anniversary of the name change to the Boys and Girls Clubs of America. Boys and girls. <laughs> it's crazy when you can remember something from 20 years ago, but we're not going to dwell on that. Okay. <laughs> you know, over this Thanksgiving week, I was uh, sitting outside and reflecting on how fast this year had passed. You know, watching your kids get bigger, my babies, and how much they've grown in a year, and thinking about what a journey this has been, you know, for me from the Bronx from the Kips Bay Boys and Girls Club, the six train to Manhattan, and being here now with you guys today. When I was that impressionable little girl from the Bronx running to Kips Bay Boys and Girls Club to sing and dance and perform for the first time in front of an audience, I didn't know what was in store for me then, but I knew that in the Boys and Girls Club I had a place to go, a place to find me and who I was, to be me, and to be with people that I trusted, who were good to me, who cared about me, and who I cared for. And to be with other kids who were also finding themselves and exploring their dreams and aspirations. While I was trying to learn and explore who I was, the Boys and Girls Club was there like a family away from home to support me. The club encouraged us to believe in ourselves and to be great at whatever we decided to do in life. And that's why I'm so honored and I've accepted being a co-spokesperson <laughs> with Denzel. I am thrilled to work beside Denzel, who has worked so tirelessly for the last 18 years as a national spokesperson and whose life was changed by the Boys and Girls Club, just like mine. Instilling in him the idea that he could attend college. Denzel, thank you so much for all that you've done and for asking me to join. I, I feel really special, thank you so much. So we have the next phase of this journey. So now more than ever, our children, like we mentioned before, need a safe, creative, and nurturing environment to explore the potential of who they are and who they are to become to address the serious issues that face too many of our young people today. A great way to take action and to make difference is to support the Boys and Girls Club in the community where you live and work. You know, the other day I was asked in an interview if I miss the Bronx, and I said no. And the journalist was like, oh. she looked all surprised. And I said, you know, I never miss the Bronx because it's always like right here, right here. All those memories, it doesn't matter where I wake up and what part of the world, where I'm working, what I'm doing in a big house that I live in now. I'm just always right there in the Bronx, right there. I never miss the Bronx because it's always with me. I guess, you know, I'm always going to be Jenny from the block, and I'm proud to say that I'll always be that girl from the Kids Bay Boys and Girls Club. And to say that the Boys and Girls Club will be right here for you, always. Join us in helping kids be great and attain great futures. Thank you. <laughs> A little off. <laughs> hey. <laughs> How old are you there, Jennifer? Five. Five. 
five years old. Jennifer doing her best, Princess Leia. <laughs> Looking awesome, of course, be extraordinary. Once again, a big thank you to Jennifer Lopez and congratulations. And thank you, Denzel, for again, all you've done and continue to do for the Boys and Girls Clubs and all our great kids. And let's have one more round of applause for our national spokespeople and everyone involved in this wonderful event today.